How's everybody doing? Welcome back to my channel. This week, I'm gonna be tattooing the Aztec God, uh, which also belongs to the Mayans and the Olmecas, Quetzalcoatl. The placement is gonna be the right side of the chest, which I'm gonna be extending it all the way up to the shoulders. So with that being said, let's get this day started. Let's go. Y el pegue, lo traigo como goma. Si no entendiste, ahí te va en otro idioma. Si pitufo que ferefes, a pesar que cofo zapas, mapa lapas. Copo mi pico fue fenífica pa mapa. Sopo lo fue ya para efe, pa para pa que fe te fe. Defe lo fue que ferefes, pepe lo fue si pitufo. Ya va, vámonos. Yes, sir. Let's do it. Moment of truth. Ya estuvo. You ready? <laughs> That's where it is. I guess I'll never read, I guess. <laughs> this is it. This is officially your first tattoo. Yes. Because that first one didn't yes. count. <laughs> no, that first one. So I have two, actually. Oh, two? I have this one over here. Let me see. Oh! But it, like you can feel it, the lines and everything. Oh, yeah. yeah was, I got it from the same guy. So. Same guy. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> You're like. Same guy, so. <laughs> so this one was first. Mm -hmm. And then I got this. That one. one was first. That one was first, yeah. And then you said, do another one on me. Let's go, let's keep going. Let's keep going. I'm, I want to get a sleeve. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to get a bunch of Chinese letters. Oh, man. So, so when, you got, when you got this one, was it all with the homies? Like at the, at yeah, the, house, yeah, at the house, hanging out? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I was there. And like everybody, like my sisters, my, my cousins, you know, everybody was there just trying to get tattooed by, by whoever, uh -huh. really, because... And at the time, he was like the only guy tattooing in the neighborhood, so I was like... Was it in Mexico or here? No, here. Oh, here? Yeah, it was here. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, he was just learning, so we were like, his canvas. <laughs> That's, he was booked up with your family. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and you were 14, and <clears throat> your siblings, how old were they? Uh, they older than me, so they were like, you know, 18, 19 at the time. They were a little older, but... Wow. We just didn't... We didn't really know where to go or where yeah. to look for tattoo artists. artists. Yeah. So we're just like, okay, he's he's got a machine. Let's. let's go. <laughs> it's like, uh, and then the only artist that was willing to tattoo a fourteen-year-old. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's that's dangerous zone right there. Yeah. All right, let's go to the middle of the shop. We're gonna we're gonna put on the stencil. And don't ella agradecer y doy gracias porque tú me hiciste. Were you able to sleep last night? I was kind of nervous actually. Yeah, last yeah. night you were like, oh, shit. I woke up like two, three times in the middle of the night. <laughs> You're like, is it time? Is it time? Am I late? <laughs> that is what I'm going to be covering up. I don't know. I have no idea how I'm going to cover it up. <laughs> I'm kind of nervous. <laughs> uh, my goal is for the bottom of Quetzalcoatl to land on the nipple area because this is the darkest part of this tattoo. So I need this to land here. So he can have a, you know, so I can black it out. If you're thinking about getting your chest done, I highly recommend for you to black out the nipple. It looks weird when you work around it, when you, you know, leave it open, when you leave it negative. It looks really weird because it just looks like a little pepperoni. Perfect. You landed right, the, the darkest part of this piece landed right on the nipple. That way there's not, you know, uh, it's going to be really easy to black it out. What do you want me to start? <laughs> You're the expert. <laughs> You're the expert. You tell oh. me, get ready, here I go, wherever you uh, I choose the nipple. <laughs> 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 Yeah, nipple and doing the uh, cover up. Damn, that's sick. Yeah. The placement, huh? I'm saying. Well, let's do it. You ready? Let's do it. Let's do it. I'm gonna have you lift your arm up like that. Like, boop. Yeah. Do you like that pillow? You want me to take it out? No, that's fine. Oh, that's fine? Yeah. Okay.
was a few times where I felt pain right around there. I was like, okay, he's on the nipple now. Oh, <laughs> we're about to get there. Just remember, it's an experience. <laughs> if that makes you feel better. <laughs> what can I say to make you feel better right now? I don't think there's anything I can say. It's Anyone can say. Uh, it's not gonna hurt. <laughs> it's like you're tickling you. Yeah. <clears throat> it's like a massage on your pecs. That's what I'm saying. You're just gonna be mad that you don't have more than two nipples on you. Because <laughs> to experience that more than two times. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect song. I'ma start on the uh, what is it that areola? Areola? Yep. Areola. Yep. I'm gonna start on the areola. Work my way up or towards the middle where the nipple is actually located. How's that? It hurts, but it's not as bad. You're a fucking beast. Besos en el cuello pa calmar la sed. Eh, abana abana abana, rakata, rakata. I'ma do the whole areola, areola first, and then I'll do the actual nipple. Oh, shit. Work my way to the middle. What do you think is better, that or Yankee Don Omar? Oof, that's a good one. Whatever reason I think, I like Don Omar better. Don Omar, yeah. me too. The rhythm. John Sebastian? Oof. Or Jose Jose? Oh, that's a, that's a tough one. I was going to say Vicente Fernandez, but that's an obvious answer. Yeah. No. Jose Jose oh. or, or, or John Sebastian? because I grew up a little more with Joan Sebastian, mm -hmm. and I know, you know, like, the poet that he was. Mm -hmm. I mean, oh my God. Yeah. So I think I, I would go with, with Joan Sebastian, but I do love Jose Jose. Yeah, Jose Jose has yeah. that voice. That's crazy. Paquita del Barrio. <laughs> oh, Paquita, dude. hands down. Hey, Paquita, no matter who it is. <laughs> No matter who you put her against. I like listening to uh, rock too. I like rock. Mm. But El Tri was everything. Did, did you ever listen to rock? Yeah, I actually went to see El Tri a couple times. No way. Yeah, when they came here. That's sick. Yeah. I went to their latest one, which was uh, maybe four years ago, here at the Al Capri. Okay. They came here and I was like, I gotta go see them, because if I don't go, <laughs> I was gonna... Yeah, because yeah, they're, yeah. they're in the point where they're about to retire, yeah, you know what I mean? I was like, it's now or never. Yeah. Bro, you're a pimp, bro. What the? Oh my god. That's it. <laughs> Thank God it's over. <laughs> oh my god. Yo, Ooh. I'm not gonna lie. Ooh. I think you're the first client I've ever had that handles the nipple like that. Yeah? Hey, dude, we just put having right. a conversation and shit with me. <laughs>
you feel like you were not gonna make it at some point during the, the whole session? Honestly, yes. You were like, I don't think I can make it. <laughs> <laughs> After the nipple, I was like, what am I I'm, doing here? I'm about to tap out. No way, for reals? It was bad. What made you not want to say stop? I couldn't go home with like <laughs> half tattooed and like couldn't do it. No I way. Still, but I mean, I would have never like known that you were hurting like that, you know, because you were so relaxed. <laughs> and that's the thing. I think you talking to me during the nipple thing, it, it helped. Having weird ass conversations. Yeah. <laughs> Ha sobrevivido, muchachón. <laughs> barely. Yeah, barely. <laughs> I barely made it. <laughs> Thank you for coming back and watching this brand new video. I really appreciate you. Let me know if you... <laughs> let me know if you've had... Let me know if you've had... If you've... If you've... If you'd... If you'd... Okay, like St. Jude. Let me know if you'd like family feud. <laughs> let me know if you'd. Let me know if you'd. <laughs> let me know if you. Maybe if I say it fast, maybe it'll sound more natural. Let me know if you've gotten your nipple tattooed. <laughs> anyway, oh, that, whatever. Let me know if you'd had. Let me know if you'd. Let me let, let me know if you'd had your nipple tattooed. And if you have, let me know your experience. Drop a comment, like, and subscribe.